Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with 2020 Tops Tier 1 Baseball 12 box. Pick your team number 5 from jazbeescasebreaks.com. Very big thank you to all of these lovely people for getting into the action right here. Oh, there's a dent on that. Edge grade 8. Friday the 5th, 12 box, pick your team 5. Thank you. Emma, Last Spot Mojo, Detroit Tigers. There's everyone else right here. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. We were just talking off camera before we started the break. Jack B went to went to Harris Casino and uh, playing some Pi Gal. He said it was kind of weird, half empty. Obviously, the tables can't be crowded. Huge bottle of disinfectant. Can't touch, or you can't touch chips. Can't touch cards. Can't get all of these boxes out of here. Well, that's, that, that is a mess. Thankfully, this is my break of the night. Nick will be coming on a little bit after me to to do uh, Court Kings, I think, is after this. Yeah, thanks, Will. Yeah, I think Court Kings after this and a few other breaks. All right. <laughs> that was kind of a mess. There you go. Six on one side, six on the other side to make 12. Good luck, everybody. Oh, how, they, how do you think they're going to do poker, Colin Sullivan? Colin's saying, I'm better at poker than I am breaks. I feel like there's a little more skill involved in poker. There's somewhat some skill involved, but a different kind of skill, I feel like, in, in group breaks. This game, this is more about finding value in different teams, especially in picker teams. Kevin Newman to 395. More of a stock market -y feel to this. Pirates, that'll be for Joe Kroll. So one relic, two autos. Bryce Harper, four out of 30. That'll be for Rick K and the and the Phillies. Let me, let me run and get some more 75 point top loaders. The poker area has changed to more slot machines, Jack B? Is that where at least at that Harris? Hmm. All right, and there's Mitch Keller for the Pirates at 299. So two Pennsylvania teams right here for the autographs, Phillies and Pirates. Joe Kroll with the Pirates and Rick K with the Phillies. So Rick K, you'll get the Bryce Harper. Joe Kroll, you'll get the Pirates, Mitch Keller. So is poker, is poker done? At least, are, are the big poker rooms done for now? Because, yeah, I mean, Colin's right. you got to have a, have a good handful of people. I've never played in a poker room. I play with friends a lot, but, but I feel like you do have to have a decent amount of people to, to really, really make it fun. Otherwise, otherwise you're just playing head-to-head -head poker like, like you're in rounders, and, and you're playing against Teddy KGB. He beat me. Straight up. Pay that man his man. There's Matt Beatty. 121 to 395 for my Dodgers. That goes to Joe Kroll. Picked up my boys in blue. <laughs> All day long. Check, check, check. Five out of 25. Dale Murphy. Speaking about in real time, what is that saying to you? I mean, there's an appreciation. 
Gold Ink Auto. Going to the Braves. That'll be for Joe Kroll. I like those old Braves uniforms there, too. And we've got Jed Lowry. To three to two ninety nine. that is, for the Mets. Joe Kroll with the Metropolitans. So, Jackson, they don't make enough money in those poker rooms. The slots bring in more money. As long as they load them up with Buffalo Gold. Buffalo! Nick, something Nick and I talk about frequently is that we think that if Tops had a slot machine, I don't think they'd ever do it. My argument was they're they're they they're positioning themselves firmly as a family sort of trading card company, and they don't want to have like they don't want to have uh, um, them associated with like gambling or slot machines or something like that. But I think it's a good idea though. If there was a Tops baseball card slot machine, how often would you play? I'd be on that thing all the time. Andrew Benintendi to 395. It would be it would be whatever year it is. It'd be like 2020 Series One cards, right? And be like, and then you like, if you can get like Super Fractor, Super Fractor, Super Fractor, ding 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 ding. How awesome would that be? Benintendi going to Jeff Gordon and the Red Sox. Then we've got Dennis Eckersley, 100 to one at 20. No, it's not, Rex. It, it is the chance to, uh, to go in with your friends to buy a piece of a case together, to open it together. That's what it is. There's this guy. Right, what are you talking about, TJ? Not true. Guriel, Yuli Guriel going to Joe Kroll. No, it is it is an opportunity to 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 join into a a uh, a higher end case for a fraction of the price mm -hmm. together a group case break a group case break <laughs> you know you're, you're going in on something together that's what group breaks are. Or Shane, Justin Bieber to 395. I, I know, Riffer. Brett Foy with the Indians. There's Pudge, Yvonne Rodriguez, 209 to 299. Metropolitan's Joe Kroll. And we got Paul DeYoung, 256 out of 299. Oh, a little bit of dust on there. Let's get that out of there. All right, so that goes to the Cardinals, Joe Kroll. Oh, that's right. Yeah, Yvonne Rodriguez, obviously, is Will Christian and the Rangers. There you go. Yvonne Rodriguez, Pudge's son, is uh, Derek Rodriguez, I believe, on the Giants. There you go, see? Corey and his buddy getting together. All right, there's this guy. I know, River. A lot of kids watch those, so try not to use that, that, that word. Families watch, but I think we, I think we all get it. There's Vlad Guerrero Jr. to 395 for Toronto. Dargan Watts with that one. Uh, Al the Altuve relic goes to Joe and the Astros. By the way. 
All right, couple autos. We've got Gavin Lux, 193 out of 299. Old Luxy. Joe Kroll with the Dodgers. And we've got Merrill Kelly, 163 out of 299. Sounds like a name of a bank. Darren Redding with the, with the Snakes. All right. All right, middle relic here. Bregman. Bregman. To 395 going to Joe Kroll and the Astros. Oh, that's the patch auto. Let's slide this right out of here. Carter Keeboom, 138 at 299. Joe Kroll and the Nats. Joe, having a hell of a break here. And we've got Jeff McNeil, two color, dual relic, and autograph. 10 out of 25. When the protests are no longer happening, we still need change. We need to come together as a community, and we need action. Racism and injustice cannot exist. Our little wrinkly on the penny sleeve there, but we got it. So the, got an extra relic in here. We got an Advert Alzale to 395. Cubs or a Randy Ramos with that. All right, next up, Hideki Matsui, 22 out of 25, dual relic, Yankees. That will be for Joe Kroll. Nice. And the two autos here. We got Domingo Leyva, 11 out of 25. That'll be for Darren Redding and the Diamondbacks. And a jersey and auto, Jordan Yamamoto, 16 out of 99. Thanks, Jack. Looks like no one wants to click the schedule in the chat. But the schedule's in the chat. Try and tell everybody. To 395, our pool holes, Angels, Joe Kroll with the Halos. Two autographs is Juan Soto, Joe Kroll. 109 out of 120. He's got an excellent autograph. Nice, excellent autograph. He's an excellent penmanship. And there's Aaron Saval, two thirty-four out of two ninety-nine. I'm gonna invite, I'm gonna invite Juan Soto to Jaspi's autograph camp. Bring Juan Soto over here. You know, teach Dalvin Cook how to 
sign an auto. We can work on it. We can work on it, Dalvin. Four boxes to go. We can work on it. We got Jesus Lazardo in the middle to 395. Saul with the A's. And we've got for the Red Sox, JD Martinez, 43 out of 100. Jeff Gordon and the Red Sox. Good to have NASCAR legend Jeff Gordon breaking with us. Thanks, Jeff. <laughs> Next one is Lance McCullers Jr. to 299. That'll be for the Strohs. That goes to Joe Kroll. I guess the pitchers weren't cheating, right? Unless you listen to Trevor Bowers and his his thoughts. All right. Few more boxes to go, ladies and gentlemen. Thanks everyone for getting in. This is Pick Your Team Five. Buster Posey, pitchers still culpable? I guess yeah. I mean, if they if they saw it happening and they turned a blind eye, what have we learned recently? That that silent. You know, just as guilty for for not acting as you are acting, right? Rudy with the Giants gets that Buster Posey relic. We've got another Pudge Rodriguez out of 299 for Will Christian. There you go. Sell one, keep one. If you wanted to. Sell both. Keep both. I don't know. Give one as a gift to a to a Rangers fan friend of yours or a a catcher in your life. And we got Aaron Hicks, 87 out of 299. Yankees. That'll be for Joe Kroll. If I had one person to break with, Rex is asking, who would be, who'd you be more star, starstruck from? Do I have options? I don't get starstruck, Rex. When you're at a star level like I am, I mean, stars, no stars. You know, game recognize game, as the kids say. So there's no, no no being starstruck for me. I'd just be like, oh, hey, here's another person on my level, finally. Finally, on my level. Breaking with me here. No, not Raleigh Fingers, Colin. Definitely no Raleigh Fingers, Mr. Sullivan. Colin's, Colin's watched the show for a long time. He knows what's up. No Raleigh fingers here. There's Mookie Betts going to Jeff and the looks like this is game. Look at the little infield dirt in there. That's how he plays the game. Hopefully he plays the game with the Dodgers. And that's Red Sox edition of Mookie that going to going to Jeff. Eighteen out of eighty, Chris Sale. Also for Jeff and the Red Sox. You see that my 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 Amari Cooper hands. I was couldn't hang on to the ball there. Raiders Amari Cooper that is. Hunter Dozier to two ninety nine. Some Amari Cooper goes to Dallas and all of a sudden he's missed Mister Catch Catch a lot now. Hunter Dozier Royals. There's the Royals, Kyle. All right, and the last box, ladies and gentlemen. No, it'd be great to break with... No, uh, Starstruck by Alex Morgan? No. Lovestruck, maybe, yes. All 
All right. Bo Jackson broke with us. That'd be awesome. I feel like Bo would have some great stories. That'd be a lot of people I'd be excited to break with. Bo Jackson came and broke with us. Imagine all the cool stories. Bo Jackson, tell me about bow hunting. You know, Bo Jackson, tell me about what you're doing, what awesome stuff you're doing these days. Bo Jackson, tell me about playing with the Raiders. Bo, tell me about the time you ran, where you ran across the wall. Bo Jackson, tell me about the time you broke a bat over your helmet. You know? Man. Bo Jackson, tell me about all the cool things you do in life. There's Deion Sanders. All right. There's Gary Sanchez, 173 to 399. So the Dion goes to Joe Kroll and the Braves. Gary Sanchez goes to Joe and the Yankees. Right, Will Christian. Bo Jackson, how many deer have you killed with your bare hands? How many deer have you run down and killed with your bare hands? How far can you throw this football? Will it really go over the mountains? Bo Jackson will say yes. Bo Jackson's like a like a modern he's like a modern day Paul Bunyan to me. Like that's the kind of stuff like you you feel like Bo could do everything and anything. Nice low number, two out of ten, Corey Kluber, tribe, Brett Floyd. I know, right? We were talking Bo Jackson, we pulled Deion Sanders, another two sport guy. There you go. And the last one, ladies and gentlemen. There's Isan Diaz. Out of 10. I can't tell what it's out of. I think it's 3 out of 10. All right. So there you go. 3 out of 10, I believe. Marlins, Jeremy Anderson. Very last card. Not a lot for you, Jeremy, but we're actually, at least we're getting something going your way. Who would win in a fight, Bo Jackson or Chuck Norris? I'm going with former Oakland Raider, Los Angeles Raider, Bo Jackson. Bo Jackson has done it, done it in real life. All right, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, pick your team five in the books. That was 2020 Tops Tier 1 Baseball. Thanks for breaking with us. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. Bye-bye.